Hi everyone, today I'm going to show my child how to solve questions like this. See this question like that? Yeah, that's what I'm going to try to show. So people can two see my equations. two steps equation. That's what it's called in. I mean, in, in equations with in integers. Okay, that's what it's called in America. I was raised in Nigeria, so I have Nigeria what ways of. Uh, I don't. I can't remember. It's a long time ago. But this is what I'm trying to show her. So I said, when you have a question like this, you can see. Okay, let me put it here. Yeah, okay. If you can see, so your question is arrow or this is arrow. How do you call it here? R. Oh. <laughs> yeah. How do you pronounce rumbish? Arbus. What's that? Rumbus. What is rum? Rumbus. Like, rumbus. 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 Oh, you said aro. So yes. you said you pronounce it. <laughs> That's how Nigeria. And Nigeria, Nigeria will call it aro. So when you have a question like this, aro all over ten plus four. See that? Is equals to five? We can see that. Okay. The first thing you have to do is you have to. You see this one is an individual number. Mm -hmm. Do you understand? So this is an equality sign. Do you understand? So first thing you do, you have to get rid of this number. When you move something from here, you you can cross it over to this side. The sign becomes the opposite. So like you have here is a positive sign. You see, it's plus. It means plus. Do you understand? When you move it, you're going to move it over here. You know, to the five, back of the five. So it, you're going to be the opposite sign. So... When you move it, what is the sign going to be? Negative. Negative. So now we're going to have R all over 10 is equals to, you see that? 5 huh? minus 4. You see that? So which is equals to 1. So R all over 10 is equals to 1. The sec next thing you're going to do is this. When you see a question like this, what is, does it mean? It means a fraction. Division. It's oh. a fraction too, but it's a division. A fraction is like is it is like a number. Fraction is like you half. Is that how they write? Half like is fraction. fraction. You see that? Half is a fraction. Yeah. Two third uh, two third is a fraction. So we have like arrow. This means division. That means that ten is dividing arrow. That's what it means. So when you move the division to the to the opposite to the uh, past the equality sign, it becomes what? What's the opposite of division? Mm, subtraction? No. Oh, I thought you said I thought you said addition. Sorry. Okay. Um, multiplication. Multiplication. So now we're gonna have arrow is equals to one times ten. You see that? Because this is division here. This is division here. But when you move oh, it, oh, so I got it right. Yeah. So when you move it towards our other side, you see that? Yeah. It becomes uh, what they call it. So uh, will be, be ten. So it becomes um, so. You, it becomes 10. Yeah. So arrow is equals to 10. Do you see that? Oh, yeah. Do you see that? Do you see that? So that is the answer. So look. Oh, you want to keep going? So you see that? Are, can we do, are we going to do one, this one? 